I'm Michael O'Flaherty, I'm Chief Commissioner of the Northern Ireland Human Rights Commission and we're here in Derry, Londonderry today to make our contribution to Derry City of Culture. We, um, we're, we're delighted to bring together a group of the world's leading experts on the human right to culture to discuss with the people of this city uh, some of the most challenging issues around how you honour and promote and respect the human right of culture in societies that are coming out of conflict or are divided. I think events like these are really important in terms of the networking that would happen here, the understandings, hopefully they will be catalyzed and continue to work in the future and to link up people. But I think hopefully people here who are working on culture would get a better understanding of what cultural rights are and that you can apply. They are actually international human rights standards and norms and treaties um, that help us to move this forward. And so that is the challenge before us. How do we interpret history? How do we teach history in ways that everyone is included? Um, that we hear the other voice, at least we acknowledge the other voice and the other perspective. And therefore, as I said, a bridge to the future. I think what's critically important for me is to ensure that there's implementation of the right to culture uh, because we have too many examples of where there's denial, either a denial of history or a denial of an existence of a people, a denial of identity of people. So I think once we begin to look at implementation of this collective right and individual right as well uh, from a human rights perspective, then I think it'll, it will enrich the world. It'll enrich um, humankind, if I may put it that way, uh, to, to focus on the strengths of our diversities. We as the Human Rights Commission see it as critically important that we reinforce that sense that your cultural identity, the expression of your cultural identity, is your human right, your entitlement. This is world-class uh, work that's being done here in Derry over these few days and it will result in the production of a set of recommendations that will go to the United Nations General Assembly for debate and discussion. So we're making a contribution globally to how we understand culture and human rights and we're also saying something of significance as a contribution to the City of Culture celebrations. <laughs>